Hey YouTube, Slick Sportsman here. I wanted to come at you with a quick 100 mile torture test of the Irish Setters um, 2875. These are Vapor Tech waterproof and they're 17 inch hunting boots, um, also snake boots. They are, um, I would say, the best snake boots that I've come in contact with, which are really good for a warm type environment. This is a waterproof full grain leather upper and it's, they say it's an ultra dry waterproofing. It also has a scent ban so that it doesn't start to smell if water does get inside or if your feet start to sweat. <clears throat> and it does have abrasion resistant fabric on the outside as well. Obviously snake proof. So these are perfect for hunting or I use them a lot for fishing. They are probably the lightest boots I have ever picked up. I mean, literally, if you were to take off this section of the boot, you would have basically a, um, a sneaker. Um, they do fit very much like a, a sports or an athletic shoe, like a sneaker. Um, they are extremely comfortable, extremely light, and probably the best ones that I have found for a hot environment. They do come with uh, gripping on the side and the bottom, which can actually is good for using with an ATV or riding a motorcycle. Um, they are waterproof. I have seen some reviews saying that these boots are not waterproof and that they leak. I can tell you after walking about 100 miles in them and even wading in water um, while fishing that these boots are waterproof up to this point here on the tongue. Obviously if you go over that you're going to have water that's going to seep in. I have had no problems with any type of the seals uh, letting go or uh, leaking any types of water while wading in them while uh, fly fishing. Um, they, I cannot attest to how they are with a snake strike because knock on wood, I have not experienced any snakes out um, close enough to bite me. I have come across snakes many times, um, but usually they see me and run. I have yet to step on one and have to test out the, uh, how good the, um, the striking um, or how good the bite resistance is on this fabric. It is incredibly durable. I've noticed walking through really, really thick jaggers, which actually ripped my pants above or snagged my pants, leaves nothing on here. Uh, you may get like a line on here. It is like a almost, this material here is almost like a suede but it is abrasion resistant, so it's not gonna tear or snag. So they claim that this boot is 40% lighter than any other snake boot or waterproof type boot. And I have to say, that is absolutely correct. Um, I went to um, the local Gander Mountain just to try on a bunch of snake boots before choosing this one. and. I really couldn't believe how light this is. I mean, it, from the moment you put it on, I had no rubbing on my foot, ankle, pinching, anything. The boot fit really like I was trying on a pair of Nikes or Reeboks or, you know, um, brand new um, sneakers. And when you're out walking around, they are incredibly comfortable. Pair these with some high Under Armour sweat wicking socks in the summer months and it works perfectly in keeping your feet dry even inside of the boot. Um, like any type of boot like this, if you're going to get it and wear it in extremely hot temperatures, and I'm talking like 90 degrees, which I do live in a warm climate, the summers do get from 90 to 100 degrees. Um, and sometimes I have to put these on if I'm going to hunt in or fish in a location where I know that there are a lot of snakes. Um, you're going to have um, some sweaty feet. Actually, with 
the Under Armour socks, it will keep your feet completely dry. And the only part you'll notice is you might have some sweat on your jeans, or I tend to use like Columbia outerwear, um, light pants, which are thinner and fit inside this boot really well. And I might see some sweat on them when, my, when I take off the boot. But my feet are completely dry. My leg is dry because of the, um, the Under Armour socks. Now, like I said, they do have a wraparound right here in step, which is perfect for pegs on an ATV or a motorcycle. It's also really good for climbing tree stands and getting some extra grip there. The bottom is an extremely durable and really nice uh, tread pattern for um, gripping. Even on rocks, on slants, I have found that these grip really well. Um, they don't really get let you slide. I have tested these out in sand, in mud, like I said, wading in water for probably a good, you know, 20 minutes up to the point in the tongue that is waterproof. The inside is lined, but very lightly. Uh, the tongue is very thin. There's hardly any lining on it. Um, you would, I'd say the upper portion of the boot, so from here up, it's a pretty thick padding, but I found it to be thinner than any other type of um, snake boot out there. Like I said, this is probably the thinnest and lightest um, for any type of warm climate. If you're going to be out in really harsh, cold temperatures, you may want to go with a, um, a heavier boot. But these work for great, um, I'd say, cool to extremely hot temperatures, this is the boot you're going to want. Like I said, they do have a scent band lining to control um, bacteria. They do have speed laces, so you can um, really get these on and off real easy. I haven't had any problems getting them on and off or, you know, taking a lot of time to lace these up. As far as sizing, um, these are an eight and a half. I tend to wear a nine in a running shoe, so I would go a half size lower. They do come in D, E, and I think double E widths, um, which is another reason why I really like these. Um, I, these are the D's, and like I said, I want a half size lower than I normally wear. So as far as slick deal, you're going to want to get them on Amazon, and I'm going to put up the link for you. They're going to come in about $183, and you really can't beat Amazon. And if you have Prime, you have uh, free shipping back if you do have any problems with them or if they do not fit. Uh, I am a big believer in Prime. They've never given me a problem. It's as simple as printing out the return label and sending it back. There are a couple other vendors on Amazon that will sell these for closer to $189. The lowest price I've found is on Amazon and that's at $183. Alright guys, that's the Irish Setter Vapor Tech Snake Boot. Thanks a lot for tuning in. Catch you later YouTube.